talking about. Just what I came after. Oh, you not. Like seven pounds? Oh, yeah, we got some back and forth. Oh my god! Oh shit! Ah! Ah! Got it! Holy crap! All right, folks, today, right now, it is almost two o'clock. It's two o'clock. We're going to hit four spots. One for each hour until six o'clock. Same river, four different access points. Three of them are bridges. We're gonna stay at each one approximately 50 minutes unless we're just really, really doing great. Uh, and we're gonna see how we do. Just like just doing spot hopping. Um, little small Ozark stream is all it is. Mostly. Spotted bass, sunfish, smallmouth, and goggle eye. And I'm just gonna use light eight pound line and uh, throw swim baits and twister tails, crawdads. And uh, I'm actually targeting, if anything, I'd rather have goggle eye than anything. Uh, but I'm sure I'll catch a variety of fish green sunfish, orange ones. Smallies and spots, maybe even a catfish. Uh, this creek is kind of very strange because it'll be real cold in one section, then it gets hot in another, and then it'll get cold again because it has some, depending on what creek meet in there and springs and whatnot, it warms up and gets colder according to what section you're on on the stream, and it can really make a difference in the quality of fishing at certain times of the year. Oh yeah, got one. What do I got? A little small mouth. All right. Hey, it's a fish. All right. Little small mouth. Got him on the Clear white swim bait. All right. Oh, and he fell out of my hand. And he went in the log. All right. Got something nice. I don't know. Man, it's real nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, man, he's wrapped around the log. And there's another one following him. Oh, he got out. He got out. He got out. Nice small man. Oh. Bit my tail off, too. Bit my damn tail off. Yeah. Before I am zero and four, I have had four smallmouth fall off. Wilman just caught a smallmouth on a worm underneath the bridge. I'm zooming. Yeah, we're getting ready to go to spot number two. It's about 12 inches, it looks like, from here. Good job. She also caught another smallmouth and a bullhead while I was gone. All right. Well, let's go to the...
goggle eye. I know, I know I can catch them here. I just want to hit even every spot evenly. Now we can't do that. Right, folks, I got a little tiny goggle eye. and there's two sucker fish they won't bite them suckers they're not dumb now, that's not a bad one all right i got the war mouth that i was telling you about i got him i've never seen one look like this it has orange fins at the top it has t orange tips Folks, this warmouth has an orange tip on the bottom tail, the end of the regular tail, and then orange tips on the dorsal fin. Pretty little warmouth. That's strange. Never seen one look like that. It's not a hybrid. Cool little warmouth, though. Alright, something different. Got a bass. All right, got one of them. That's the small one though. All right, folks, I just caught a little, about 10 inch large mouth and it fell off again. God, I'm targeting a big three pounder that's sitting in front of me. But he's really smart and he knows I'm here. I finally outsmarted him. I've, I've been sight fishing this bass for 30 minutes, guys. Got him, it's a large mouth too. I didn't think he would ever bite. I mean, he said he knows I was here and I had to catch a goggle eye and warm mouth, thin through some sunfish and I finally got him. <laughs> I've been watching this fish for ever since I came over here swimming in circles. Yeah. All right, folks. It's a nice little large mouth. On a red wiggler. back in. I got the fish I've been wanting. They don't happen very often. It's not bad, huh? <laughs> I can't believe I got it. Alright, long ear, new species. Four, five kinds, counting smallmouth that fell off. Would have been five. Pretty little long here. Yes! Another warm mouth or goggle eye, one of the two. War mouth! Another war mouth. Hooked him on the bottom of the lip. 
and pointing down. Same size as the last time. And it's got the same orange fins. Cool guys, another war mouth. Rare to catch two in one day like this. In a stream, especially. That is really cool. I knew that's what it was as soon as it darted out from the brush pile because it was real dark. I love warmout. Even though they're small, they're just a cool fish. Definitely a cool little fish. Yes! Nether goggle eye on the swim bait. I just threw it in before I was going to walk away and caught a goggle eye. And this one ain't bad. He's actually six inches, almost seven. Folks, I got what I came for, and I, this is the biggest one of the year, sadly enough. I got me a little goggle eye. I just threw my swim bait right where I've been catching all those fish on the worms, and he just darted out. I'm surprised you haven't gotten any, because you're over there in the rocks. There just ain't that many, I guess. They're over in this brush pile. All right, that's cool. Two warm mouth and two goggle eye and a big bass for a stream anyway. I missed four small mouths and I was starting to have a bad day. My reel's acting up, but uh, it's turning out to be okay now. Yeah, better. We're going to get him back in. I'll see if I can catch another one. We're about to go to spot number two. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. There we go. Smallmouth. I only got one that didn't fall off, guys. Yes. Not a terrible one, but no giant neither. But as a start, I finally got one that stayed on. A little smally. And we've got a serious erosion problem over here. Look at that. This is the upper reaches of a smallmouth stream, too. That's just horrible. And then cattle in the water. And they wonder why the rivers are declining. I've already noticed I've not caught a goggle eye this year over six inches yet. Very rare for me. They're usually eight inches. A lot of eight inches. We get every year. I don't know what the problem is. Yeah, I got one. Oh, we got all. There he is. All right, I got him. This time it's a spotted bass. Little spotted bass. Hey, we got a variety today, guys. Nothing worth bragging about, but a lot of fun. Got him. All right, a little spotted. Ooh, ow. By little, I mean little. <laughs> oh boy.
green sunfish. New species for the day. I believe that makes six kinds. Got him. Oh, he got all. Oh. <clears throat> Oh yeah, big green. Beautiful. Wow. That's a nice green. Too bad. Nice little large mouth. Not a pound. And a green one. Good female green. There we go, real fish. Stay down, stay down, stay down. Oh, nice large mouth. Oh, yeah. The trick is you don't want these fish jumping today. Any room my swim bait, I gotta go back. Well, it was fun while it lasted. You never know, I can try it without the tail, but odds are against me, probably. Gosh, I knew it was gonna happen eventually. Nice little large mouth, though. Find out if I can get a fish without the tail. I'm sure not as many, maybe one. There'll be definitely more picky. It's more like a wacky one type looking thing now. Cinco. It still works. It still works, folks. Nice green sunfish. Swim bait with no paddle tail on the end. Still working. Nice little green there. The black spots on it. On each end.
There we go. Yes, nice, Greeny. Well, now I got the biggest of the day. Wow, that is, whoa, wow. Look at this. I'm not dropping this one. Now that's a green sunfish, guys. It finally paid off on getting a keeper sized of one of the kinds I was catching. That is a great green right there. Without a doubt. Let's get him back in. Wow. There we go. What have I got here? Oh yeah, feels good, feels good. It's a greenie. I guess this section of the river just has a ton of greenies. I don't know what the deal is. It's a nice one though. Every one of them's fairly decent as long as you use bigger lure. Heck yeah. There we go, nice greeny. I seen him come out. Big old black shadow just dart out of that tree. Another nice one, not as big as the last two, but they have a decent average in here for greenies anyway. Got the little zebra stripes going, faint ones. 